What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Kirby giving you guys a new video on this glitch that was introduced to Sword and Shield. As you can see, this fall pix is kind of sus. Let's find out. Alright then, so as you can see on my screen, this ball pix is kind of sus. We have an imposter among us, and it's clearly this Vulpix. You're probably asking, how? Well, I'm glad you asked, my good friend. So for some reason, thanks to the introduction of Pokemon Go to home, this happened. So if you have a Galarian Rapidash, or my bad, a Galarian Ponyta, or a Alolan Vulpix, it automatically registered them as their Cantonian version, which is very weird because it's not supposed to do that. But for some reason, when you transfer your Vulpix or Ponyta into from Go to Home, it automatically does this. Now, I'm gonna answer your questions on what can you really do with this Vulpix? Uh, I tried to breed it, but it seems to correct it. So it gives you the correct move, which I think it's Powder Snow. It will never give it, but I do have a uh, one in my party, which is this egg. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to hatch it and we'll see if it actually gives uh, the same move again. I highly doubt it. So I'll come back to you guys when it hatch and we'll find out if it has those uh, Cantonian moves. All right, Dan, so you can see right here, it is hatching. We're going to find out if it has the Cantonian move, which I highly doubt it's gonna do it because I already checked this, but since I wasn't recording, I'll show you what moveset does it have. It's in my party right now. This is the one that it was. And as you can see, it gives Powder Snow. Uh, and it has Snow Cloak, which it's alright. Alright, so I went ahead and saved. We're going to go ahead and uh, battle a Pokemon and see its move in action. Awesome. A hey, Nicket. Okay. So let's go ahead and throw out our Vulpix. Boom. Chakalaka right there. Shiny. And uh, let's go ahead and use the uh, Fire Spin. Let's see this Fire Spin um, Vulpix. Oh my god. That's so hilarious. That is so cool. Okay. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie, that's actually pretty cool. Let's let's go ahead and battle another one. Let's actually use flamethrower this time. Let's use flamethrower. Look at That has to be the most coolest thing I've ever seen. Like, holy baloney. This is a really cool um, glitch. Now, the other question I'm kind of curious, can you use this Vulpix in battle? Um, not battle, but VGC. Let's go ahead and take it out from our party. We'll see. I'm not sure if it's gonna let me because it doesn't have the mark, but maybe. Maybe it's that's the reason it won't let me, but we'll find out. Now, if I can use this in, in VGC, this would be cool, but I don't think it would. But we'll, we'll find out. We'll find out. Rank battle. Okay, so I need to give it ready battle symbol. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. All right, so we're officially here at the battle tower. Now, we're gonna try to see if we can give it the, the symbol, which I think it might eliminate the moves. We'll see. Hopefully it doesn't. Uh, let's use this Vulpix right here. Vulpix would need to forget all its move. Okay, well, you can't bring it into VGC, which kind of sucks. Um, now, I wonder if I'm able to join a raid with it. Uh, I wonder if I can or not. So let's find out if we can actually join a raid with this Vulpix. All right, let's go ahead and select this Pokemon. 
there's a problem with the Pokemon that you selected, so you cannot actually bring it to raids. Interesting, interesting, interesting. So you cannot bring the Pokemon to a raid. Okay, so that answers that question. So you can't bring this Pokemon to the raid. You can't battle with it because they'll forget all the moves. Now, I, let's, you know what? I don't think it's going to save you. Alright, so I just gave my Vulpix a Ice Stone. I'm kind of curious if it learns new fire moves or it actually corrects the movesets. We'll find out. There it is. Full Galarian, Galarian, of uh, Alolan Vulpix. Dazzling Gleam is a fairy type move. We're not going to bother doing that. Keep old moves. Okay, so um, let's go ahead and give it some EXP candy. And to see if it actually learns more fire moves. Interesting. It did not learn a single fire move. Let's go ahead and use our uh, Alolan Vulpex and see how it looks when it's doing fire moves. So um, let's do flamethrower. My God, look at that. That is so weird. To see. Oh my God, that's actually pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, it avoided it. Wow. Okay, Blizzard. That shouldn't be too much damage. There's Fire Spin. Oh, baby. Look at that. Let's see if you use will o -Wiz. I think automatically you can use will o -Wiz with Alolan. I'm not really sure. But let's go ahead and see that animation of will o -Wiz. Alright, let's see this uh, move. Look at that. My god, that looks so cool. Alright, let's finish this thing off. That looks so cool. I'm not, it doesn't get, I cannot get tired of seeing that. It's hands down one of my favorite things. Alright, so let's go ahead and go into the move tutor to see if it actually remembers any old moves uh, like fire stuff, but I don't think it will. I think it's going to automatically correct it. Alright, so we're here at the move tutor guy and uh, let's go ahead and hit remember move. So it automatically remembers the original moves that it supposed to have so you can't keep putting fire moves to it so the game recognizes that this is a Alolan Ninetales and it won't allow it to have fire moves but Pokemon Go to home automatically get fire moves so outside of the standard set that it automatically gets that's all the fire moves you're gonna get from this Pokemon so the things you can really do with this Ninetale is go into raids offline battle random pokemons and that's about it really you can't breed it you can't go into rank battles if you try to give it the rank mark it will um, automatically eliminate all its move and give it the standard snow move so yeah it's not much you can really do now i don't have enough to give it its hidden ability but it would just probably be the same thing so it won't be any different so the game recognize the alolan Vulpix standard stuff to it, so it won't give it sunny day. Um, but if it does, that's really cool. I just don't have the the shards to kind of like give it the hidden ability, so I can't find out for you guys. But let me know in the comments below if you found out. I'm pretty sure it doesn't give it the sunny day passive, but let me know. But anyways, what do you, let me know in the comments below what you think about this glitch. I think it's hilarious. I think it's very awesome that 
you know, this Alolan Vulpix is so unique. So, sadly, you know, I can't breed it or do anything with it, but it's a really cool, awesome, one-of-a-kind Vulpix that I can show off, you know, to other people offline or just show pictures of it. But, yeah, it just sucks that I can't really use it online, but it's the same thing with the Drill Bird when it had Surf. You can't use Glitch Mons on, basically, rank, so or rank or online raid so it just kind of sucks but it is what it is but anyways uh leave a thumbs up comment below what you think about this glitch and i'll see you in my next video have an awesome day or night peace